for me that shout. I play my dick, get big as the apple time. So I can fuck the world for 72 hours. Goddamn, I feel amazing. Yo, 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 what is up, YouTube? It's your boy, if I got Q, bring episode four of Nothing to Titan White Draco, bro. And let's get into it. We're giving the 28XX we got from episode three. We're going 28XX and five crits for Bubbly. That's a pretty good deal. Um, That was a really good deal, if I think. But uh, that Bubbly's not going to stay for long. Sorry, I really actually like Bubbly. But you just got to do what you got to do. So let's get into the next right here. We gave four crates. For a Neothermal. It looks like an overpay, but he did not want overdrives or turbos. And the overdrives are so hard to sell. I even mind overpaying a little bit because overdrives are just so hard to sell. But luckily, he took the deal. So I really appreciate that because. Oh, I'm never. I don't want to touch another overdrive again, but I'm going to have to because crates are crates, I guess. Crates are crates. But, um. Anyways. Here we're going to be giving away our bubbly for three labs acc at clockworks and the nitro crate pretty good deal that's a 1.2 off for bubbly's 1.2 so i was like why not so um yeah three labs all that for a bubbly not bad i wanted to get four but it was too hard so uh, i just did three and now it's not just just three and just get me to 1.2 but um here we gave the clockworks for uh two accs i was a little bit hesitant but i couldn't get any offers so i was like you know what bro i'll do it why not have to do it i just need to sell all this stuff for crates so i can get more mystery decals or paint exotics you know what i mean so we give it away for two accs not a bad deal accs for about three or four uh crates of peach peach i said peach freaking nut peace but yeah we have three lives three accs nitro three overdrives and one neo thermal here we get three accs for all this we just needed items we, we needed a lot of items so i gave all these crates for some items that i can just sell for regular crates so um i think it was pretty worth it actually like we had some pretty good stuff he gave some pretty good imports we could sell for crates so i was like cool beans cool beans oh on to our next trade we gave um he said what do you want i just said all i want is some crates and then i said i'll do this he was like all right i really didn't want the overdrive i tried to make him give me the acc but he wouldn't so um we got nitro and overdrive <coughs> we bought it for two overdrives and two turbos so we made a little bit of profit because nitros are two crates each so honestly not that bad not the greatest profit but we didn't make really pro i think it was like even we might have like overpaid by one but here we sold a mantis for five crates so the accs we gave him we gave each accs about three to four each so that's a that's a big profit off one night when we got five crates not the best crates but crates are crates if you mix them up you can get a mystery decal easy if you just mix them up with some good crates so i did that um here we go let's get into the next trade shall we next trade he was trying to give me Trinity. I was like, boy, I have a Trinity, and it's certified. I don't care about that. He was like, all right, what will you give me for this? I was like, I'll give you. He's, he didn't need Trinity, so I was just going to give it to Kumi RXT. And Takumi RXT is only worth one to two crates, and this is worth 34, so that's automatic profit. These The three ACCs we did was amazing because we made so much profit off of it. So, um, yeah, pretty good trade. On to the next one. I don't, I honestly don't know why this dude did it. I gave him a Trinity for that Stegosaurus and the Triplex. Triplex are easy to sell because it's a Nitro import. Everyone wants Nitro imports for trade ups. So, easy profit. Trinity, that's so hard to sell. So, we're just making profit off the pat. I honestly don't know what the Stegosaurus was. It just looked cool to me. I was like, I guess I can easily just sell it for something, hopefully. But, um, here we gave uh, three labs to get 20XX. So basically we sold the bubbly for 20XX and ads basically, because all this stuff was just from that, uh, the, uh, the stuff we gave for the 20, for the bubbly, the stuff we sold for the bubbly. So um, on to the next trade, we sold the triplex for an overdrive and a turbo. Like I said, again, not really the best crates. I kept trying to negotiate with him. I was like, bro, can you trade like the crates? Please just change them. He wasn't budging. He wasn't answering me back. So I was like, oh, fine. Why not? 
Why not, bro? Just mix up the crates, I guess. But we haven't too many. But um, in this video, you're gonna see me mess up a, a big. I messed up kind of huge, bro. I messed up huge. But at the end of the video, we still got a mystery decal, so it's all cool. But uh, here we gave a Centio Magic Missile for not uh Mantis. Centio is so hard to sell. That Magic Missile is so hard to sell. Like these these overdrives anything with overdrive is just hard to sell in general so i was like all right why not Mantis is easier to sell but um here we gave <coughs> here we gave two overdrives for some titanium white oems um i don't really know how much they're worth but uh last time i sold some i got like four crates so i was like maybe we could do it again but um yeah pretty good profit i think the overdrives were kind of trash anyway because they're overdrive so I wasn't I wasn't mad. I think it was a pretty good trade. But um yeah. Here we gave a mantis for two ACCs. So basically six crates. I would take that any day. They only sell the three to four that the max. Last time I got five crates and now I'm getting two ACCs. My luck with the mantis is too high. I need to just keep getting mantises and just sell them. Basically, I need to just start doing that to be honest. But um yeah, he did that trade. I was pretty happy. And yeah. Here, we gave Saffron Kalos for a Jaeger. The, the, the Saffron Kalos was too hard to sell. My bad, I accidentally forgot to record this part. I sold all my crates and my white OEMs for the um, Saffron Kalos. They are uh, like, I'll make profit. Turns out, no, Saffron Kalos is way hard to sell. Don't ever do it, guys. But uh, yeah, we just traded for a Jaeger. Here, we gave a Jaeger for Orange Octane. Draco's two Nitros and Octane. Dragon Lord, like I said, guys, I, was, I messed up in the video buying that Kalos. It completely messed me up. Completely messed me up. So I basically had to start all the way back over, bro. All the way back over. But luckily, your boy is a trading god at this game. So here, we gave these Dracos for three crates. PCC and Turbo, not that bad. PCC sells for two crates each. Overdrive, whack. Nobody likes overdrives, but it's three crates. So I, I would it didn't really matter to me. But, um, yeah, here we gave one crate for a taco boost. He didn't want to overdrive, so I just did a turbo. He was completely cool with that, so I was like, thanks, bro. Honestly, I took a big risk, but it's only one crate, so it's like, whatever. I don't know what it's worth, but, uh, we ended up making profit off of it. Here we gave the taco boost for, uh, Sky Blue Wildcat Ears, so that's about three to four crate profit. Sky Blue Wildcat Ears are worth four crates. So yeah, about three crate profit right there. But um Yeah. Here we gave the orange octane for eight, nine, ten, eleven crates. Overdrives are trash, but it don't matter because that's still a lot of crates for our orange octane. That was my best offer I could get. And the CC4 is worth three crates or two crates each. So um uh, it wasn't honestly that bad, but uh overdrives uh just mix them up, you know what I mean? Um, here we gave the CC4 for two PCCs, which are really good crates. PCCs and nitros. So, uh, yeah, we gave it for two PCCs. Pretty good deal. And we're getting our inventory slowly back from that huge mess up from the Saffron Kalos. So, I'm really happy about that. But, um, yeah. On to the next trait. We gave the Sky Blue Wildcatters. I thought they'd be easy to sell. They weren't. This dude wanted them. And he gave me Dracos, and they're worth basically the same amount, and it's certified. So I was like, huh, maybe a little bit profit. I think it is a lot of profit because, like, the Dracos are easier to sell because they're they're exotic wheels. You know what I mean? <coughs> but anyways, here we gave here we gave the Dracos for three turbos. I was like, can you just mix it up with like a crate or something? He didn't, but I just, I'll take three turbos because we don't really have no turbos. So I was like, you know what? We need them. Um, but yeah, I ended up trading with the same guy again. And there's next trade right here. Trade with the same guy. He wanted my Dragon Lord because it looks better than the Quillowat, he said. So he gave me two more turbos. I was like, cool beans. I just need crates to get Mystery Decals and yeah pretty good pretty good trade in my opinion if i like i think because you barely can even get one crate for it but i got two so not a bad deal <laughs> one crate profit we're one crate profit but here 
we gave three ACCs for, uh, I mean, not three ACCs, one ACC for three turbos on common and Kalos are only worth three crates. So you threw in some exotics that were worth two crates. So that's about a two crate profit right there. And turbos aren't the best, but crates are crates. And yeah, bro, on to the next trait. Here we gave her overdrive for a very rare trait because I know I can sell it for more easily, easily. So I did that. And I ended up trading with him again because he had another one. He had, I think, a tune smoke, I think. I forgot. Let's, let me check. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It was, a, it was a tune smoke. Yeah, we ended up giving it for a tune smoke. Another old drive for a tune smoke. He just wanted crates. He didn't know you can get about two crates of peats for it. And I ended up making a lot of profit. So, um, really good deal, bro. The boy's a freaking trading god right now. Like... I took a L with the Saffron Kalos. I bounced back though. Like I'm, I'm getting my inventory back slowly. But um, yeah, here we gave the two very rare boosts for um two ACCs, which was worth three crates apiece. So I made a four crate profit because I, I I I gave two crates for two of them, and I just got two ACCs as worth three each. So yeah, four crate profit right there off the bat turns out the dude did the trade him got titanium white lining so i'm a freaking i gave luck to him with those as well so yeah bro here i gave two accs for five grades because i really needed it because I, I wanted the biomass this dude was holding it for me he was like bro hurry up so i was like you know what, bro i'll just take this underpay a little bit underpay but not bad we got uh we needed this for the final trade which is coming up right now um here yeah. Final trait, we get 24 crates for the biomass. He really wanted 24 crates. I was like, here you go. Um, so yeah. Final trait. Hope you enjoyed the YouTube video. Hope you enjoy it. Nothing to titanium my Draco episode 5 coming in two days. And your boy is out. Peace. I feel like a Gucci ad lip bird. Go to the Coca Cola mascot, Coco Bird. Put my salsa lasagna, it can make Garfield perk. I ain't really fucking with these niggas like a dyke.